Oh, guys, we're having a breach issue. Breach water issue. Maybe I should have dug down more uh, instead of up. Uh, too late now. Too late now. Hey guys, this is the Matrix here. Welcome back to another Minecraft episode. In today's video, we are going to be building a little bit of nether entrance. Um, nothing too fancy or special. Figure we might as well build it on the floor, seeing that everything is up above and a bit of a struggle to get through. I finished off a, a lot more of the roof that I'll probably show you guys at the end of the stream. Well, not in the stream, the end of the video. It's like more than halfway done now, I think. You can kind of tell. I cleared out a little more of this area. Um, been all, all week so I've been having a little more time to do stuff I mean I should have way more time I should have gotten way more done than what I have to be honest but I've been kind of relaxing and stuff as well but yeah we're just gonna build like a little bit of a stumpy tree we're gonna go ahead and get right into this but yeah no it's just gonna be a little bit of a thick stumpy tree that's gonna be an entrance into our little nether cave right here so I'm just gonna like kind of follow the same pattern like it's gonna have like these little logs sticking out there not gonna be anything too difficult to try and create here the entrance is a little bit tricky though nope, just because of the dimensions of the tree like without having um without it having any gaps and stuff like that okay i think that's more of the right way around but yeah no just a little bit of a side project because I have no idea what to do with the house stuff right now. Like, I don't know if I want to necessarily, um, like, start, like, just wrap up that house, that tree house soon, and, like, start building houses elsewhere. Don't know about that, really. But, yeah, no, I guess it's okay to do something else for now. And just kind of see how it goes. But, yeah, no, this is going to be, like, a rather stumpy tree. And like a thick stumpy tree is what we're gonna have. But I am already out of the rest of my jungle wood. Okay. Do need to think about sleeping soon because there are mobs always around me. Uh, I did have like a row and a half of sand, by the way, right before that was the last thing that I did. Went off somewhere there, but I was doing it at night like I am now. And I kind of got exploded by a creeper. Yes, I did have full iron armor. Well, it's more than what you expect. So I lost my stuff. I lost all the sand I got there, but I think that's about all I had. Don't think I had anything else important. I didn't know where I was, so that's a bust again. Because creepers can now apparently explode and kill you on easy. Well, not on easy on normal mode. Nothing too exotic, you know. This just be my little nether fortress in the ground. Um, aside from the nether portal that I already do got. I think I got way too many leaves, but it's okay. Yeah, that tends to happen. Alright, so I should, I'm should i gonna get this uh, right here, and that should be enough, I think. I kind of don't know, like, what many more projects to work on, really. Because the, ho the house is just kind of like, you know, kind of off-camera stuff a little bit. I'm not that creative when it comes to thinking of this stuff here. Not without thinking of some time in, in my uh, world and stuff. So, you know, just something something along like this, just to kind of spread it out a little bit. Spread its uh, roots out. Maybe, like, put some stuff in the ground as well. Not too bad. I think I can get rid of that. But yeah, now I can get back on up here. Uh, yeah. I guess that this is, um, okay. Now for the tree. I kind of have a picture of it, but it might not look exactly like it. But that's okay. Can you place oak leaves on jungle wood and it like count the same? Like it be as one or something? Get out of here. Man, I've been having this zombie creeper problem ever since I moved in here. Not really been working out. Not really. 
All right, so I think I'm gonna get rid of these edges here. But yeah, no. Go ahead and get put that there. Uh, that there. <laughs> you guys see what I mean by being a rather bit of a stumpy tree? It looks kind of cool for uh, like literally two minutes of creating. But yeah, no. I think this is supposed to be more centered, but that's okay. It should be fine. Yeah, then let's dig down here. Hopefully not to like a big ravine or anything. And I'm just gonna create some more ladders. Dig a little bit of a room out here. I kind of need some torches. So, I think I'm gonna go down one more. And then I'll be good there. Okay. So I need some torches. I need some, steal some coal for a second here. Get some torches going. And uh, dig out this room. Alright, let's go do this. Let's go have ourselves a little bit of another, another tree room thing. Kind of like keeping it the same with the rest of the theme here, I guess. Go down one more. Alright, so yeah, I don't know how big this needs to be. I guess I'm just going to start digging. It would be nice to have like a faster pickaxe, but I lost all my levels, so. Like after I had to die from the nether in the last episode, because then it marked down the portal coordinates. But that's okay, I guess. One, two, three. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Should be enough. And I think that's sand, so. Should be enough to go down six this way. And then, uh. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right. Now here comes the fun part. How can I keep you guys entertained while I'm trying to do this here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think I'm gonna go back eight that way maybe. And then uh, just to go ahead and start getting rid of this. I think I need to get rid of one in the ceiling too. But yeah, no, I was just thinking about placing a few uh, brood stands down. A couple chests. Maybe look, maybe look, maybe make it look like the nether maybe. Um, I don't know how much nether like material. I don't think I have, uh, maybe I have uh, some nether fortress material from digging up the side of it. And maybe I have some nether rack too. That could be kind of cool to make this area look like the nether a little bit. Maybe add some like streams and lava or something. Which I could probably go get. That'd be kind of cool. I'd be kind of saving this episode a little bit. Doing something like that. Oh guys, we're having a breach issue. Breach! Water! Issue! Maybe I should have dug down more. Uh, instead of up. Uh, too late now. Too late now. Well, this is fantastic. Hey, well, at least I could get more sand out of it, I guess. But hopefully it's not ruining <laughs> the servers above. I mean, I think my dog's like right up there somewhere. Hopefully he doesn't <laughs> pop down out of the server. That would be kind of funny. I mean, it'd be annoying because then he'd be in the way. But, and maybe drowning. I wonder, I wonder if he's seeing this. Like, what's going on? What's my owner doing on down there? Oh man, not good, not good. Uh, it's gonna be a wreck up there probably. Uh, I'm gonna, I might have to place the sand back down. We'll see, we'll see. We got, we got a leaky roof now, you guys. Maybe I need to place half slabs above there. Maybe I need to dig down as well. I don't even know. Oh my goodness. Okay. The yeah, end. No, I'm just getting rid of this ceiling so I can have some headroom. But I think I got, you know, like a good depth buried. Any dig dug away. Whatever you want whatever it's called. Anyways. This is just also just so I don't have to be climbing up and down that tree every time. Like maybe I should have more of my essentials down here, like many in like tree bunkers like this. The only problem is if I do it too close I might run into another bunker. Oh, I don't know what to do about that. Maybe just dig down a little further. But then you risk it to going into the ravine or something. Because uh, there is like a mine shaft right below me. I don't even know. Could be kind of cool though to have like little stations like this, you know. 
do it right, I guess. It's like I got kind of lucky with this one. A little bit. That not go down too far or anything. Okay, uh... So yeah, no. Kind of need to go get my nether stuff. And just kind of see if I can transform this room a little bit. And make it look pretty. Yeah, no, I guess if I just go get rid of this floor. Like, maybe we have like... Will it work to have two strips? One, two, one, two. One, two, one, two. Okay. One, two, one, two. Yeah, um, it could work to have two strips. Just go down like this. Not anything too fancy. But, yeah, no, I guess if I just do like two strips. I don't know how much diorite stuff I have. But, yeah, no, this might look better than doing another quartz or something. This is diorite. This stuff that I'm picking up. Okay, looks like uh, we can actually use this stuff right here as well. That'd be nice. And there's some more stuff in the walls. We're using the material that we pick up, you guys. This is awesome. Same stuff's gonna go right back in the ground, but just in a different uh, form. All right, very few times I ever use this stuff, really. Like, literally. Kinda don't know what to do for that, just, um, maybe like at the very edge is when I can have like, this, uh, this go down that way, maybe. Which I don't have much of this stuff, so I have to go back into the nether. And like maybe when I go and uh get more blazes, which I think I got like 20 blaze rods right now, and like maybe the wither skeleton schools as well. Going to hunt for them. Oh, that was perfect. Oh, that makes that's happy. That makes me happy. <laughs> um. I mean, I know the other side is not complete, but that makes me happy right there. That was perfect. Okay. Man, I'll just have a strip like this go down. Should I have, like, just another strip of the same thing? Or should it be something different? Uh, I guess the same thing for now. And, yeah, like I said, maybe we can have, like, lava coming down. I think I might just do the floor for now. Maybe we'll do the ceiling and have lava coming down from the sides. Either off camera or on another episode. But, yeah, no, just something different. We'll see. We'll see what the road takes us. But maybe we'll just get at least this floor done for now. That'd be kind of cool. Yeah, no, not looking too bad. Like, uh, once this gets completed in as well with the stuff, it won't be looking too bad. But yeah, then like I said, maybe I'll have the same pattern going up the walls with lava and stuff like that. Um, then like I said, maybe we could do like a storage room with a tree with one of these trees somewhere else and like maybe have one more like have have one have this be the another area have like that be a storage room and that be something else important right there maybe like a tree farm or something or like an animal farm or something have like three or four little stations going on over here that'd be kind of cool we got another zombie incoming you guys another zombie incoming but yeah i guess for now just uh place these three down there Oh, why you set me on fire? Why you set me on fire and do that? Yeah, let me know what you guys think about the tree idea, if I should do that or what. Uh, it's going to be kind of an odd number. But I guess I'll just place those two down there for now. But yeah, it looks like that's going to be the end of this episode here, guys. A little bit of progress on some more stuff, just because I don't know what else to do. But with that being said, I am going to go ahead and end off the episode here. So thank you all so much for watching. And from Mr. Matrix, I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out.